In this video, we'll show you how to update your AVR to the latest firmware and some setup basics. Once the room is ready to go, it's a good idea to check to see if the AVR has the latest firmware. To do that, simply press the info and direct buttons on the front panel. This will display the latest firmware version. To check for the latest firmware version, visit the product page of the AVR on our website. To install the latest firmware, you'll need a blank USB stick, load the firmware update files onto the USB stick, and insert the USB stick into the back panel. To update the firmware, you'll push the info and the display button together to engage the firmware update. The firmware update can take up to 15 minutes, so be patient. This is also a good time to prepare the measurement positions before you run the calibration. When the firmware update is complete, be sure to reset the factory defaults to engage the new firmware. Check the user manual for all the detailed instructions. Next, be sure to go into the setup menu to set some of the basic configurations, such as speaker type, speaker size, surround configuration, and subwoofer. In the General Setup menu screen, be sure to set Control to IP so that AVR can communicate with the Dirac Live software over the network. It's a good idea to run a system check by playing a couple songs or a few movie scenes to be sure everything checks out okay before you run the Dirac Live calibration. 